welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Jacqueline Ann. Thank you for being here. And if you're not new, thank you so much for coming back. So today I have a Lululemon haul. I am really excited about this haul. These are a few things that I picked up last week, um, last Tuesday's drop. So today is Monday. Um, I'm recording, I always record on Mondays. So um, these are from last week's drop. Everything came in over the weekend. I am really excited about the things that I ended up picking up. Um, the colors I am so excited about. Um, these just scream fall to me. So even though I can wear some of these pieces while it's still nice and warm right now, the colors are just more leaning toward fall, which is exactly what I'm going for right now. So if you are interested in seeing what I got, then stick with me. And if you like this video and you like this kind of video, please don't forget to hit like and subscribe and let's not waste any more time. Let's get right into the haul. Okay, so the first item that I picked up is in a color that I have never had before, and I do think that it's a new release. It might not be, so don't quote me on that. Um, it is the color Smoked Spruce, which I am absolutely loving, and I got several pieces in the color Smoked Spruce, but I have never had this before, and it's the it's Rulu Run Half Zip. Um, I think it's Half Zip. Yeah, it's Rulu Run Cropped Half Zip. I am so excited about this, both for the color and also just the style. I had looked at this so many times last year, put it in my cart so many times, and then just never ended up with it. And so I'm really glad that I pulled the trigger early in the season so that I could take full advantage of it because, like I said, last year I just never did. Um, I really love that it has this half zip and it's a nice thin material. This is the, what is this fabric? It's just Rulu fabric, which is soft, sweat wicking, four-way stretch and quick drying. Um, and it is has added Lycra for stretch and shape retention and it was treated with no stink zinc. So um, we love that. It says that the underarm gusset improves mobility and minimizes chafe, thumb holes, cuffins, zippered pocket, reflective details, slim fit, cropped length. So um, I love everything about it. I love that it has the cropped length. I love that it is a really um, thin but super, super soft fabric. I love that it has the thumb holes, the cuffins. Um, mostly I love this color. I, I am so, so happy about this. I think it's such a pretty fall color. I love that it's sort of a cooler tone as opposed to um, a more yellow undertone because that's just what works with my um, skin, with my color. So um, so this is what the back of it looks like. You can see that it has sort of the rounded seam here and it does have kind of um, dart type seams um, on the side and it is cropped. It's not, does hit at the top of my waistband. It is not extremely cropped. It's just the right amount of cropped. Um, I did get this in a size eight. I really could have gone with the six. I tried both. I got this in store and I tried both the six and the eight on six would be more my true size, but I do have to size up a lot of times just for more room in the bust and shoulders. Um, I absolutely could have done the six, but I just felt like the eight felt more comfy and that I would be more likely to pull for it if I just had that really comfortable feeling um, the way that the eight felt. So um, I ended up sticking with the eight. I really could have gone with either. I hope I made the right decision on that, but um, I just really love the way that this fits. So really, really, I mean, this is just an awesome piece. I can't believe I haven't gotten it before. I'm really excited about this one. I'll probably end, end up picking this up in more colors for the upcoming fall and winter season because I don't run but I could and I know that this is intended for running and I am not a runner I'll use it for walks I'll use it for um just general every day I could see myself using this casually um so so much because it's just the perfect light layer but it's still warm but it's not going to overheat you just perfect so really excited about this new item for me. Okay, so next up, I picked up the Groove High Rise Split Hem Pants in Nulu, and I picked it up in the color Smoked Spruce also. Um, so basically, the Groove Pants that we have been loving for, since last year, um, it's very similar, but not exactly the same. There are some absolute differences. So, and I really like these. So let me show you what the differences are and why I actually really appreciate it. 
I like that this is, it feels like it's just slightly less um, super high rise. I feel like these are more, maybe just a little bit more high rise than their normal high rise, but they're, I don't think that it's super high rise, although it might be listed as, but it just feels a little bit less high rise, which I appreciate because I am just, I don't need quite as high a rise as the grooves usually give. But it has these seams in the front. So if you'll notice, this is not the way that the groove pants um, are um, constructed. So it has this seam here and then these seams that go down. And I feel like, I feel like it's a little bit more compressive in this area than the regular groove pants are. And I kind of am digging that. I just, I think it's a nice feature. It does, um, it feels very similar. I mean, the fabric is exactly the same, but just the way that the seams are here, I personally feel like it has a, just a little bit more um, compression. So I feel like it's even better because it's it doesn't just let everything hang out the way that the grooves sort of do. And I love the grooves, but I think that this might be even better. It feels really good and like kind of sucks me in just ever so slightly, but only in the most comfortable way. So I am really, really happy about it. But so this is what it looks like in the front. It does, like I said, does have these um, little dart type seams that don't continue all the way down, but um, it does have those in the front. And then this is what the back looks like. Um, so this is just a straight across seam. Here is the logo, um, and it does have a seam down the side of the leg and at the bottom, which I can't show you all in one piece, but at the bottom there is a split. Now the thing about the split, which totally works for me, I am 5'7 and it falls at exactly the right length on me, but I am a 5'7 with all leg. So, um, if you are not 5'7", there is a good chance that you will have to have them hemmed. And I'm not sure how the hemming situation would work um, because of the split. So just depending on how much you would need to have hemmed off, I guess, would determine how well that finished product would end up looking with the split. So I just, I'm not sure I am, I don't do this, so I'm not really sure and I've not heard anyone's experience with um, having to get them hemmed yet. But overall, I would say I absolutely love these. I will probably end up picking more of these up. I wasn't sure if I was going to really, really care for these in this green color just because I really like pants that are um, super versatile. I want to be able to wear my pieces over and over and sometimes I rather, um, you know, just really neutral. But I feel like that this is Although it's green, it's a pretty neutral green, so I feel like I'll be able to pull for it really often. Um, love that it sucks me in. Love that it just, it fits really nice. It's super comfortable. I like the split at the bottom. I feel like the split is perfect because um, the shoes that I will wear with it likely in fall and winter. Um, so while it's warm right now, I'll definitely wear slides, but in fall and winter, very likely to wear like the, um, low Ugg boots and, and stuff and so that just leaves our tennis shoes and that just leaves the slit leaves the room for the you know for them to fall around it can't get my words out I'm sorry but I just really like the split and I feel like they fall nicely with um, the shoes that I am likely to wear during the cooler weather so that kind of solves um, not a problem but it does make it easier to wear the footwear that I would usually wear whenever the weather is cold so um, Anyway, I really, really like these. I definitely highly recommend, and I'll probably pick them up, the split hem style in um, another color or two, because I love it. It does just that slight bit of compression. And I did get these in a size four, which whenever I get single lined aligns, I usually size down to a four. That is my normal groove pant size. So um, if you're between two sizes, I mean, I would say stick true to size but if you are between two sizes, you could probably go with your lower size, but I do love these. Okay, and the next thing that I picked up is um, one more piece in the color Smoked Spruce, and this is the Base Paste Tank Ribbed, um, and you can see that it is ribbed. It has a eraser back, and it is sort of just a cooling, sleek fabric. Um, 
I love this. I have this already in a pink color and I wear it pretty often. It's just such a nice lightweight. It's sort of waist length. It has this rounded hem at the bottom um, and it is just super versatile. I can wear it a lot and I picked this one up because I just love this color of course for the fall and I thought that this was a smart purchase because I do still get a lot of warm weather even though it's technically fall or it will be technically fall very soon I'll still be getting warm weather for a while so this is just a way to um, change my wardrobe to a fall wardrobe but still be able to get um, you know to be cool enough so love 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 this style tank it's it's something that I pull for pretty regularly so um, I'm just glad to get another another one and the smoked spruce I can't get enough of it so um, yeah really love that I was able to grab just a basic top in the smoked spruce Okay, so switching gears a bit, that is it for the smoked spruce for this haul. Um, the next thing that I picked up is the High Neck Align Tank in the color Natural Ivory. Okay, so if you have watched my previous videos, you know that I picked up a High Neck Align Tank in the um, White Leopard print. Um, to go with the white leopard leggings that I had picked up. And I did not like the way that it fell with the leggings. There was just too small of a gap and it sort of um, just my skin would sort of roll out. It, it was not flattering. So I decided to return and I ended up getting a full length tank and I also ended up getting a um, just a regular bra top to go with it because both of those options just worked better for me. But I was very, very remorseful about the fact that I didn't keep a high neck aligned tank because it was my first try. And um, I really loved the tank. I just didn't like the way that it happened to fall with the aligned leggings. So I decided that I was going to try, I had already decided I was going to try again. And when I saw that they dropped this color, this color is um, just such a beautiful neutral without it being such a stark crisp white. So it makes me feel a little, less nervous that I will mess it up and I just love the neutral color of it and I thought that it would go so so well with the um, smoked spruce items that I have and I love those two colors together so um, I decided that I would try it again and I am so excited that I decided to try it again because with the um, smoked spruce um, groove pants Sorry, I just couldn't, my brain wouldn't think there. Um, with the groove pants, they come to just the right level that it is not just creating that, you know, roll that, and I know that skin rolls are normal. Don't get me wrong, I totally understand that. But you know, you you wanna feel really good and you don't wanna have to be tugging at your clothes. And so that works with it really well. And I did actually have some of you guys that told me to try the super high rise. And I think that because this is more of a super high rise um, pant, that it works well with it. So that was great advice. I absolutely love this color, this style of um, a line top. I love the high neck of it and I love it with those pants, which means I'll be able to wear it with all of my groove pants and then the super high rise type leggings. And um, I love the way that that hits me proportionally so much better. So really, really cute. This is what it looks like. It's got the high neck. It does have the um, built-in um, shelf bra. It does have the removable cup pads. These feel nice and secure. Sometimes I have trouble with the um, ebb to street cup pads, but these feel nice and not, I'm not sure why I have trouble with those, but these feel good. Um, and so I'm hopeful that they will be able to last me for a little bit, but this is what the back looks like. Um, and you can see that the logo is right there in the center. Really, really, I just think that the Align high neck tanks are so, so pretty. I am not a big fan of the um, lower cut Align tanks. So this alternative is perfect for me. And I am really, really excited that I got it, that it works. Um, so I definitely recommend these. And if you are fuller busted, which is the reason that I don't like the lower cut ones, um, and you don't have one of these yet, I definitely, definitely 
um, recommend that you give them a try. Okay, and the last thing that I picked up is the Scuba Oversized Half Zip, and this is in the fleece, which kind of looks like Sherpa. I'm not sure what the difference um, between Sherpa and fleece is exactly, but regardless, um, this is called fleece, but it has that teddy bear sort of um, look. So, as soon as I saw this drop, I picked it up. Um, I am not, I actually give these Sherpa slash fleece um, jackets, I have a really high standard and I usually end up rejecting them and I'm not sure that I'm not going to end up just returning this one and I'll tell you all of the details on it. First of all, um, usually whenever I am shopping, I'll look at these and feel them and nine times out of ten, I feel like they have just a texture that um, people consider it soft and I touch it and I'm like, that's not soft enough. This one is soft. It is, it is soft. It's not um, the softest fabric that I've ever had, but it is not scratchy. It doesn't catch your skin and do that like I don't know exactly how to describe except that this is nice and soft so I can definitely say that that is a great feature um, it is not in the inside of it does not have that um, really soft fleecy lining that we are accustomed to with the regular scubas it has this Jersey cotton lining which means that um, although it is constructed very similarly to the way the um, traditional scubas are made, it's actually two layers. And for that reason, I feel like it feels sort of bulky as opposed to just that really cozy feeling that the normal scubas have. Just This is just my opinion. I think it's really cute, but for me, it, it feels a little bit bulky. Um, it does still have the thumb holes, but I would also say that the um, there's not as much stretch here in the opening for your wrist. Um, and so I also notice and feel that and it just takes slightly away from the cozy factor. So I just want you to be aware of those couple of things. Um, but otherwise, it is basically exactly the same as the regular scubas. Um, the construction's the exact same and I would say that the fit is pretty much the same, but it does feel a little bit different because of um, the double lined and because of the um, opening here. So um, I like it, but I don't love it. And so for that reason, I think I am going to end up returning this one because I just, I wanted to love it really, really bad, but I don't love it as much as I wanted to love it. And that's not where I want to be. And I just have a feeling that I won't pull for it as much. It definitely is the sort of thing that I would consider keeping because when you're looking to create this look, this cozy Sherpa style jacket look, it definitely creates the look. But I am a girl that will not wear something if it's not comfy, if it's not cozy. And I feel like I pull for these for the cozy factor and if it's not the coziest, then it'll get left behind in the closet and I'll pull for something cozier. So for that reason, I think I'm gonna return it. Tell me what you guys think. Am I crazy to return it? Cause I do have a feeling that these will be popular and I have a feeling that they'll sell out. Uh, they haven't sold out yet, but I just have a feeling that they'll be pretty popular. And so if I return it, there won't be any going back. So please give me your opinion. I just, um, I don't want to hold on to it and just spend that kind of money and not get the wear out of it that I should. But at the same time, I'm afraid to have FOMO. I'm afraid to have the fear of missing out. Um, so I think it's going back, but please, by all means, tell me what you think. If I'm crazy for getting rid of it, please tell me. Um, but that's just my opinion on it. Um, take it for what it is. It is really cute. I, I will give it that. But um, anywho, that is the last thing that I picked up in today's haul. Thank you guys so much for being here. If you have not already followed me on Instagram, you're going to want to do that because I um, post the things that I am picking up 
and how I style them, but also if I see something's been restocked that you guys are looking for, um, new drops, things that might sell out quickly, um, I give you a heads up on Instagram. So if you're following me there, you are mo more likely to um, see the things that you know are hard to get your hands on. So um, don't forget to follow me there and um, I will see you in the next video.